Welcome to the first video on how to service the ASX560 auto sampler. A common task is to replace the Z drive. First, make sure the power is turned off. To remove the Z drive, loosen the thumb screw on the rotor on the back of the auto sampler. This releases the peak cable. Loosen the nut on the Antec Inc. swivel block. The entire peak cable can now be pulled out. Holding the Z drive to the arm are these two screws. Reinstalling the Z drive. Insert the peak cable through the anti kink swivel block. Feed the cable around the rotor. Then tighten the nut on the swivel block. Adjust the end of the cable and push it under the clamp on the rotor. Using your fingers, tighten the thumb screw on the clamp. When the probe is raised, there should be a small gap between the slider and the cap. The Z drive needs to be attached to the nut that rides along the Z arm. Here's a trick for hitting the holes. Feed a thumb screw through the hole, then push the Y arm over the nut. Push down on the thumb screw as you slide the Z drive forward until it finds the hole. Tighten both thumb screws with your fingers.